Today is National Black Poetry Day. Yes, we celebrate things other than Black History Month in Kwanzaa. And on this Black Poetry Day, I honor the greats. Turn up the bass, check out my melody, hand out a cigar. I am letting knowledge be born, and my name is the R. Eric B. This genre embodies the American dream at its purest form. Every day I'm hustling. Every day I'm hustling. Every day I'm hustling. Every day I'm hustling. Rick Ross. When it started, it had no beat, but that didn't last long. I bomb atomically. Socrates, philosophies, and these hypotheses can't define how I be dropping these. Mockeries lyrically performed. Hip-hop has many layers. Hip-hop gave men an open forum to be vulnerable. Girl, you look good, won't you back that ass up? Juvenile. Hip-hop makes you critically think. Real G's move in silence like lasagna. Lil Wayne. Hip-hop is spiritual. I pull up at the club VIP. Gas tank on E, but all drinks on me. Wipe me down. Hip hop wondered aloud why Christmas missed us. Told the story of how birthdays were the worst days. Now we drink champagne when we thirsty. Notorious B.I.G. If hip hop could talk, it would say, unsung, underrated, underappreciated. The one of them underachievers had underestimated, finally graduated, I'm one of the most hated. Black thought. Hip hop has left us with some memories that we will never forget. 201-330-8004. Mike Jones. You ain't real if you don't remember Mike Jones' phone number. I'm sorry, that's facts. Enjoy National Black Poetry Day and treat yourselves to some hip hop classics while you're at it because hip hop went from negative to positive. And it's all good. If you don't know, now you know.